This is the list of 21 netiquette rules. You may pause this video and then write them all down. The learning objective for this topic is that after watching this video, students can identify the rules of netiquette. Netiquette can be defined as the code of acceptable behaviors users should follow while using the internet. What is acceptable behavior? Acceptable behavior is equal to the rules that we should follow while using the internet. So in this list, there are 21 rules. Another definition is netiquette is the term for politeness when using the internet. Internet is a network. That means we will be using many applications while on the internet such as we using email, social media, message board, instant messaging and also we will be using the world wide web. Also online discussion. How to apply netiquette is actually simple. Just treat other people you communicate online as you would like them to treat you in real life. What is the importance of netiquette? The guidelines that constitute good behavior on a network to ensure benefit of internet can be gained by everyone to avoid negative actions that may cause inconvenience or even harm to others and to respect others' privacy because internet users come from different background and nationality. Millions of people using the internet but not many people realize netiquette exists. Just because they think they can hide and cannot be traced, make them sending or posting message that may cause inconvenience to the other. How to promote awareness of netiquette? Netiquette can be promoted using printed media such as poster, pamphlet, brochure, magazine, newspaper and display them in public areas such as buildings, schools, colleges and also shopping complex. Advertise the awareness of netiquette on electronic media such as televisions, online social networks, e-magazine and also e-newspaper. Organize program, campaign, competition such as at school so that the community can be aware on netiquette at the early stage. Acceptable behavior or netiquette rules number one until number seven. While composing an email, use meaningful subject line. Subject line is the title of the email that you send. A meaningful subject line helps your recipients to organize their email message. It also makes sure the recipients want to open the email that you send. Number 2 Try to keep message that you compose by using email or instant messaging is just a brief message. Every message typed by using email or instant messaging must be kept short and simple. If you have a long text message, send them as an attachment. Number 3. Use proper grammar, spelling and punctuations. Improper use of grammar and many spelling mistakes just make the sender look unprofessional. Always proofread your message before sending it. Number 4. Try to type a message that is clear and concise. When composing an email, you should be as brief as possible while still making sure to include all the pertinent or relevant information get right to the point number five avoid sending spam message spam is usually connected to email services if you receive an email that you don't expect so that means you may just have received a spam email spam email is irrelevant or 
unsolicited message sent over the internet. Number six, avoid forward chain letter. Originally, chain letters were sent by email. Today, chain letters are often sent electronically via email and social network. A chain letter is a message that attempts to convince the recipient to make a number of copies and forward them to a certain number of another recipients. So, be careful when sharing a post or forwarding a message. And number seven is to never read someone else's private email. When using a public computer such as at the library or a cyber cafe, someone may forgot to log out of their email account or instant messaging account. Being an ethical person, don't read their message. Instead, help them to log out. And that is all from Netiquette Rules number 1 until Netiquette Rules number 7. Netiquette Rules number 8 until Netiquette Rules number 14 will be discussed in the next video.